interphase is the largest portion of the cell cycle. Cells spend almost 90% of their life in interphase. Interphase can be identified by the fact that the nuclear membrane, which is also called the nuclear envelope, is still completely intact. You can also still see the nucleolus. That's the region of the nucleus where ribosomes are being made. The cell needs these ribosomes so that it can make proteins. Interphase itself can be broken up into three smaller stages, G1, S, and G2. The G1 and G2 portions of interphase are called the gap phases. It's during these gap phases that the cell grows and makes proteins. It also makes more copies of its organelles to meet its growing needs. Some cells also leave the cell cycle and enter the G0 phase. This is called the resting phase, and when cells are in the resting phase, they are not preparing to divide. Some cells, like heart and nerve cells, permanently stay in the resting phase and no longer go through cell division. Between the two gap phases is the S, or synthesis phase. It's during the synthesis phase that DNA replication occurs. The cell synthesizes new DNA, and when the S phase is complete, the cell will contain two complete sets of its genetic material. Before DNA replication can occur, the DNA must first unwind and be separated between the nitrogen bases. Enzymes then add new nucleotides to create two complete sets. Once the cell has passed through the G1, S, and G2 phases, the cell will leave interphase and enter mitosis.